I'm Sofia Louvera, I'm the director of The Chinese Closet, uh, which is a documentary about the gay life in uh, China. <笑>好十五号请问你为什么要行这样好主要是主要是父母的原因啦因为我跟我父亲是坦白了这个事情然后就是呃他们他们就进柜子了所以他们会有比较大的压力所以呃我也蛮担心他们也怕他们走不出来
more like yeah these young people are fine with living these lives and like going to this market and yeah. having these like very sort of like um, compartmentalized lives in a way but do you think beneath it there is just a lot of um, pain too or like and, and why don't they discuss it that openly like mm. it, I think it is yeah mm -hmm. it's definitely it's definitely dramatic for them mm -hmm. you know lying to your parents mm -hmm. creating a whole life mm -hmm. with some with somebody like fake life mm -hmm. it is dramatic but uh, I think it's very is a cultural thing so mm -hmm. the, the Chinese I find they don't express like we would mm -hmm. so even in the film you see there are some moments of tensions when you you understand they are suffering mm -hmm. but they don't show it the way we would expect them to show it mm -hmm. And so I think that's why uh, even I sometimes thought oh, this is such a cold way, uh, yeah. uh, clinical way to 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 analyze and rationalize and, and, and deal with emotions. Mm -hmm. But I think it's a cultural misunderstanding. We can't read them. Mm -hmm. Did you then, at some point, as a director and just I don't know, a human being, stop saying, "Oh, we have to, I have to like con convert them or tell them, you know, to become more themselves"? And um, mm -hmm. and did you just choose at some point to just depict their reality and get not so involved in it? Yeah, they, mm -hmm. I th I've tried not to get mm -hmm. too involved. Even though with, uh, with Andy, this my, one of the main characters, I did because we were so close, very friends, and, and he always asked me, what do you think I should do? And I was in a position of, I shouldn't tell you, I really don't know what you should do mm -hmm. for your life. Then, mm -hmm. of course, I'm the director of the film, so I was thinking maybe I should tell him what to do, so my film would be great. And but. That would be completely moral, so I never, mm -hmm. I never uh, pushed him to do the, what I thought was the right thing, because he, he knows better than I do what mm -hmm. is good for his family or himself. Mm -hmm. And did you when, you, when you chose to make a film, did you already know what you want to show and how you want to structure it, or what was your uh, well, take on the story? When we, when we started research, no, I, was just, I went there blank, meeting people mm -hmm. and looking for stories. Then after the research, I actually sat down and, and work out the, you know, my message and the structure, the story in my mind before I start the, the shooting. Mm -hmm. What what audience do you have like in mind for this film? And what? like, or do you think about the audience when you? Oh. Yeah. Yeah. When when you when you make films like specifically with this film, yeah. who do you address? I my my ideal world. I'm addressing mm -hmm. uh, everyone because mm -hmm. the universal message is you know relationship between children and parents. Mm -hmm. So that's uh, something that anybody can relate to, mm -hmm. no matter if you're English, if you're gay, or doesn't matter. Well, that, yeah. But now I also realize after making the film, mm -hmm. I realized that is really important for the gay community, for the LGBT community, because I get people coming and asking me questions after the film, uh, and I realize this is, uh, I mean, obviously it's only a film, mm -hmm. but it, it, it does help uh, some people mm -hmm. watching it. So I'm, I really want to push it through the LGBT um, festivals around the world, because I think it's, uh, it's, it can make a little difference. Mm -hmm. How did the people react here, like the Q&As and the... Um, questions they had or comments here in uh, the yes. premiere yes yeah yes. that was great I was really I was uh, amazed uh, very interesting questions and uh, lots of questions also like what did they want to know or like what was what were their like opinions about it but most of them they want to know more about China mm -hmm. so about being gay in China so mm -hmm. they ask more about it and uh, and uh, actually they also want to know about the, the character's life so they asked me what happened to them uh, mm -hmm. after the film uh, or they ask me you know about their parents uh, so they, they get I guess they really get into the, the story they, they get attached to the to the people in the film have they watched it already the protagonists yes. or yeah, yeah, yeah. Where, where did that happen and how did they react to it uh, well Andy we watched it together a rough mm -hmm. cut mm -hmm. uh, at some point he, he came to Amsterdam wow. And uh, we sat in my, in my apartment and said, okay, you ready? We're going to watch this, you know, blah, blah, blah. It's just a rough cut, so don't mm -hmm. take it. But he loved it. Mm -hmm. it was, uh, he was laughing and then he was all emotional. Mm -hmm. And then when he finished, the film finished, said, I really love it. But do you think I'm pathetic? You know, I'm this guy who always does what uh, his father tells him to mm -hmm. do. Mm -hmm. I said, no, you're not. It's just mm -hmm. the way you are. Mm -hmm. don't, don't, uh, but he was really touched. And Cherry, I couldn't watch it with her, mm -hmm. so she watched it in China. in China. Do you think it will ever get a chance to be screened in China? 
the, the deal is not uh, is not gonna be broadcasted in China because mm -hmm. I promised to the people who were involved uh, I don't want to to, to to show it in China yeah. broadcast wise but like also television or TV, TV yeah. mm -hmm. but also it's never gonna be broadcasted because in China right. the censorship is really strict but I wanted to go through the mm, there are small LGBT festivals yeah. Uh, around China and I really wanted to push it through that because that's where you know the audience and the community that can really benefit from the film is so. mm -hmm. What was your biggest message, um, not message, lesson, lesson you learned in uh, this entire process? Did lesson. you, did you, mm. or lessons or, or what yeah. uh, challenges did you have to face, you know, like what, yeah. also for you as a director and as a filmmaker, what did you learn? Mm. Well, this is my first feature film, oh, okay. very first. So I learned a lot. Okay, I, yeah. can, I can't even begin to say how many things I learned. I started, you know, uh, I st also I was, I was doing science before I didn't study. Really? Okay. I didn't study cinema. So for what me did you was work? Uh, I, I, I was doing cancer research. Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> and then suddenly I, I changed. I, th I thought I just want to make film and I'm mm -hmm. going to try and do it. Mm -hmm. Uh, so I really learned a lot, and mm -hmm. um, but I also learned from the people. I, I learned a lot about Chinese culture, mm -hmm. uh, as well as filmmaking. Filmmaking mm -hmm. was. Uh, Do you want to continue? Yeah, of course. Doing films, okay. Yeah, definitely. What <laughs> topics, or is it? What are you? What are you interested in? What is I that? have a few topics. I want to work more with China, mm -hmm. uh, but I also have a topic uh, to shoot in Italy because I'm Italian mm -hmm. and. Uh, and as about the mafia in Italy, it's uh, a cliche. But, but what is the also the ta the situation for queer people in Italy on a yeah. um, mm. political? I mean, I don't. I know so many. You're asking me a painful <coughs> question. <It's> but <laughs> because yeah, because Italy, it's so unfortunately, much. is a, is a horrible country for for LGBT. Uh, right, it's, like it's really it's really backwards and uh, the Catholic Church is mm. uh, is a major problem mm. and this uh, I think today or yesterday these very days mm. we the government is trying to pass a law to allow uh, gay marriages mm. and uh, there is a, b a big big thing going on and uh, lots of people protest and had this family day when they go and mm. say that the family should be you know man and woman and mm. so and it's, uh, I really can't read the news when I when I see that because I mean we are in Europe and we're supposed to be uh, more advanced. Mm. But this thing, Italy is just uh, it's like maybe you want to make another film about that too. <laughs> do I, you, do I you know you great do directors who did, so I'm okay. not gonna do I, it. Okay, I okay, I, I let okay. them do it. <laughs> okay, good luck for the future and with your next Thank film you. projects in, in China. Thank, Thank you so much you. for coming. Thanks.